Good evening. Honolulu police have opened an animal cruelty investigation after a dog was found with two bullet wounds yesterday on Oahu's west side. It's an update to a story we first brought to you yesterday. Sadly, according to veterinarians' assessments, the pup named Nakoa is not going to make it. He was found yesterday afternoon on the side of the road in Ma'ili. After taking x-rays, veterinarians discovered he'd been shot twice with real bullets. One was an old wound while the other was fresh. And so it actually crashed through um, what would be our collarbone um, and it severed, fully severed his spine, just shattering the vertebrae. And so they said if the bullet had missed his spine, that we would be able to save him. But they said because it severed his spine, that he has severe damage to all of his body and he's going to be a paraplegic dog for the rest of his life. Vet said after all of this, the dog's leg would also have to be amputated. So sadly, they made the tough decision to put him down. They also performed a CT scan, which the veterinarian and animal advocates hope can help bring some justice to the situation. One of the things the veterinarian mentioned when we were talking about doing the CT was he said whether or not this dog has a good prognosis or a bad prognosis, it's actually very important to do his CT scan. And he said, because not only will this tell us what's wrong with him, the CT scan would be able to be used in prosecuting whoever it is that did this to him. The veterinarian is actually going to be pulling out the bullets and they're going to be sent, sent and turned over to the authorities to try and figure out who did this to this dog. This comes amid a reported uptick in recent animal cruelty cases that's according to animal organizations, including Paws of Hawaii. Anyone with any information about this case is asked to call police. It also thanks the public for its donations to help pay for the roughly $4,000 worth of medical bills today.